What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Unova Red walkthrough. Okay, so, in our last episode, we defeated Misty for our second badge, and now it is time for us to go straight to the Vermilion City Gym and to take on uh, good old Lieutenant Surge, and to see what kind of Pokemon this guy has. I'm trying to think of uh, what Pokemon it may have. Now, I did bring in Waddles for this occasion right here, because it's both a bug and grass type Pokemon, but not only that... P-Dub, yeah, not going to make it in this gym right here. So, this place looks like it's going to be the whole, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, it's going to be the Killer Croc show right here. So, we're going to, yeah, we're going to try and destroy everybody with Killer Croc. Mudslide may go, go in there. But here we are into the electric type gym for Lieutenant Surge. Now, this is one of my least favorite gyms because of this whole puzzle thing right here. Because you always get confused on where the, uh, where the key is located and sometimes oh there it is okay there we go we found it and nope as you can see you don't necessarily know where to find the key it's it, like all these trash cans are right next to each other it's annoying okay and then nope okay god dang it you see you find the key it's it's ridiculous okay so there we go nope not right there not right there. Not right there. Probably right there. Nope. Jeebus, okay. There we go, that's one. Oh my god, this is so ridiculous. Oh god, I hate you, Lieutenant Surge. What are you trying to hide from? I really... I'm trying to figure that out, okay? That, that, and not that. Okay, right here. Not right here. Already been right here? No, right here. Oh, there it is. So I'm assuming it's gonna be right next to it, right here. God dang it! Okay, this is getting ridiculous. Okay, so you know what? Screw it. Let's battle these Pokemon trainers, then worry about these dang keys, okay? So here we go, going up against another Sailor. And well, there we go. The sailor wants the battle coming out with his Blitzel. Okay, now if I'm a gambling man, which I'm not, I'm assuming that the top dog right here is going to be Blitzel's evolved form, which is, I guess, uh, Lightning Unicorn or something. Uni, uni, uni Lightning or something. I don't know. So there we go. Defeating him like that. Coming out with a Joltik. So let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon to Oinkinator right here. Look at this guy Oinkinator versus Joltik. And, well, let's go with an Ember attack right here. There we go. Joltik is uh, using that Screech tank. There we go. Now, we're looking at Joltik right here in real life, but I guess in the Pokemon uh, cartoon, it, it, you can't see that little thing. Alright, I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. What kind of lightweight are we talking about right here? I don't know. Okay, so here we go, going up against a Rocker, and he's co also coming out with a Joltik. Alright, Kakarok, or Killacroc, let's go with a Mudshot. And that nearly defeats uh, Joltik. So here comes an Acid Attack. That right there is not so good. So let's go with a Crunch Attack. You know, Overkill, that kind of stuff. Okay. Coming out with a Tynamo. Continue on right here. I got myself a Tynamo too, but it's not. Oh god, it's not learning new moves. I'm seriously thinking of changing Tynamo because oh my god. And well, here comes a Joltik. Let's go ahead and switch it out to Oinkinator right here. All right, Oinkinator, do your thing. Now, after defeating this guy, I we're gonna be going into another area where there's gonna be another, a nice plethora of Pokemon to actually get. And I'm excited about that. And look at that. Defeated the Rocker. And he's fried. Okay. And, well, let's take on this one more trainer right here. So we can skip ahead. Because I really, really, really do not want to look for these keys. And, well, let's see. Going up against Gentleman. Coming with his Blitzel. Krokorok. Killer Croc. Going with it. Mudshot. Okay, and well, that was easy. Pretty easy. I'm throwing out that peace sign right now, guys. And well, 
say goodbye to this guy. He's like, stop, you're very good. Okay, so we've defeated all the trainers in here, guys. I'll be right back because this is going to take a while. Knowing my, like, knowing my smart ass, I, I know I'm going to take a, a while. So I'll be right back, guys. Well, that was easy. Okay, so <laughs> we got it on our third attempt. Wow. I thought this was going to take a long time, but no, I was completely wrong. So there it is, guys. We figured out the... We figured out the uh, the Trashkins of Doom right here. Let's go ahead and slightly heal up uh, Killer Croc. And let's go for our third badge. Hey, kid! What do you think you're doing here? You don't live long in combat, that's for sure. I tell you, kid, electric Pokemon saved me during the war. They zap my enemies into paralysis. The same as I'll do to you. I love this song. Here we go. Gym battle number three, and it's against Ghoulie himself, Lieutenant Surge, and, well, he's going to be coming out with his Joltik. Okay, Croc Rock, do your stuff. Let's go with a crunch attack right here. And, bam, Joltik has been defeated. Oh, look at that. Croc Rock is just destroying everybody right now. And, well, he's coming out with an Amolga. That is one annoying Pokemon, so... Hmm... Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna keep with the the same Pokemon right here because Molga is both a flying and electric type Pokemon. If we were in Generation Four, uh, Five, it would try and per, uh, paralyze us and then just you know mess us up with that whole stuff. Now here comes its final Pokemon, Zipstrika. Look at this guy. All right, we're gonna go with uh he's gonna go with an X Speed while I'm gonna go with a Dig here. Let's go, Crocorock. Get it. Now, there we go. Say goodbye to Cr or Zip Striker. And just like that, we won our third badge. He's like, whoa, you're the real deal, kid. Fine then, take this Thunder Badge. The Thunder Badge cranks up your Pokemon speed. It also lets you fly anytime, kid. You're special, take this too. And, well, we need to make some room in our pack because, you know, whatever. Okay, so let's see. Ah, oh, damn. Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, we probably should have made uh, made some room for this whole stuff right here. Um, yeah, I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys. So here I am, back in the flesh. Had to uh, deposit a few items, and what else? What else? What else? What else? Oh yeah, deposit one more Pokemon too, just because there's something we need to get too. So. Here it is, the cr Thunder Badge cranks up your speed, da 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 da, and well, we're getting the TM24, which is Thunderbolt. I am going to give this to our good old buddy, uh, Tynamo, or Flash, because he needs it. He really does. And well, a little word of advice, kid. Electricity is sure powerful, but it is useless against ground-type Pokemon. Ain't that the truth, because that's kind of how I defeated you. I really did. Okay, so let us move on right here. Get the heck out, and, well, let's see, get Waddles out of here. So, after defeating this gym leader, I'm assuming that you talk to this guy. You have the Thunder Badge, you must be a good trainer. I just caught the Pokemon that was uh, always getting into mischief. Would you like to take good care of it? And we get ourselves a Snivy. No friggin' way! Oh my god! Okay! Okay, so... We get ourselves a starter Pokemon, Snivy. This is definitely a big change. And I think I already know what I'm going to nickname it. Oh, yes. Let me just spell it right right here. Hold on. Let's see. Hold okay, on. Okay, so here I am. Okay, so I got to spell it right. Basilisk. Silisk. Lisk. Basilisk, okay. Yes, wait, wait, hold on. Yes, I bequeath you the name Basilisk. Yes, I will treat this Pokemon right. And, well, take a look at this, guys. We got ourselves a Snivy, a grass-type Pokemon. And I'm only assuming that you can only get two out of the three starter Pokemon of Unova. I could be wrong. I haven't played this game before, but that is a new development right there. And it may or may not affect the way I... Uh, you know, I use my team, maybe. I don't know. 
I could be wrong. I, I, I still haven't thought of a good team, but there it is. We got ourselves a new Pokemon, Snivy. So in the next episode, we're, we're going to be going uh, behind the scenes and all that stuff, grabbing some stuff, and then, you know, moving on from here to get to Celadon City. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.